On 30th July 2025, physicist Dr. Syed Awi Ahmad issued a warning. Nuclear energy is not suitable for Singapore. A member of Red Dot United, Dr. Syed Awi took to Facebook to explain why nuclear power poses serious risks. His post followed comments by IAEA Director Rafael Grossi, who praised Singapore's readiness for nuclear adoption. Grossi pointed to Singapore's advanced tech, stable government, and rising energy demand. But Dr. Alwi, a physicist trained in the US, sees things differently. He says his scientific instinct warns when systems exceed natural boundaries. He doesn't deny the science, but insists the fit is wrong. The US Nuclear Regulatory Commission requires an 80-kilometer safety zone. But Singapore isn't even that wide. That means in a nuclear emergency, no area would remain safe. Then there's the issue of nuclear waste, which remains hazardous for millennia. Singapore lacks the geological space or isolation needed for long-term storage. Evacuation? Impossible. The population density makes it unworkable. There's simply nowhere to go in a crisis. Even with strong academic programs, Singapore lacks hands on nuclear infrastructure. Dr. Alwi also urges for democratic engagement, transparency before technology. Unlike large countries, Singapore cannot shift risk elsewhere. Instead, he advocates for solar, energy storage, and regional grid partnerships. In science and policy, you must respect your limits. Nuclear exceeds Singapore's. Dr. Alwi called for national debate and warned against rushed, irreversible choices.